download this game from my sponsor league to support my channel. What is up guys, it's Soul Bash. We are back today playing a new game. This is called Dragon Souls and it's very, very entertaining. I love this game. I love the side scrolling type of games. Uh, basically what you do is you start out with a couple heroes, you collect your heroes, you get them gear to promote them to higher levels. Once you promote them higher levels, you get different skills. Uh, speaking of skills, I need to go to this guy. I got him yesterday. Uh, you can farm dragons. And obviously the name of the game is Dragon Souls. You can farm dragons and they're pretty awesome. Um, you get skill points that you can put into their skills. Which uh, lets them do more damage. You get one point every five minutes. Uh, and then you can level those things up. And let's check the mailbox. Uh, Dragon Lady wasn't able to find a job. Okay. Fight Pit Rewards. We'll take a look at that stuff. Medusa was hired. Awesome. We're getting some gold today. That's good. Uh, Weak Wonders. Okay. That's from the game themselves. Quest. What we have. Overachievers. Upgrade the skill three times. So do that daily. You can get, the, get an achievement for a quest there. Sign in. As you can tell, I have been playing just a little bit. Uh, guilds, uh, there's a guild shop that you can buy stuff from. I don't have enough points quite yet. Hero job board. Uh, you can lend out your heroes uh, and people can actually buy them to help them. So that's pretty cool. And once you do that, you actually get rewarded for it. So currently right now, I am level 31 and been playing for a couple days now. Uh, like I said, I farmed the dragon up. Uh, these are the chapters that you go through through the, the daily uh, your runs. You know, go as far as you can, and this is where you're gonna farm your materials. Uh, very basic stuff. Each map looks like that, even though they have the ones like these and the you know your big castle-looking things. You've got two in between each one before you successfully can go to them and then redo those to actually farm the stuff. So it takes a little bit of time and then you have your elite ones, which this is where I farm my dragon from right here. The dragon soul stones drop from here. Uh, that's pretty cool. You can farm uh, so far at the beginning, like nine of those a day. So it, it just takes time to progress. You've got to balance your stuff, especially between magic and physical damage on this game so it's pretty cool uh, you get free chest uh, one every two days that's uh, pretty big and that one right there you open a couple times but this one you can actually get you know people out of you can get heroes from so that's pr that's pretty cool uh, let's scroll over here and see what we have um, this stuff becomes unlocked sometime I'm, I'm team level 31 now, but it's not there. It comes after a map or something. And you got a black market and a soul market over here. So that's some stuff to look at further in the game. Expeditions, uh, what those are. We'll reset it. And every day you can do that. And let's see, we'll drop her out. We'll take the dragon. I could have hired a hero, but didn't want to. So this is the basic combat of this. Uh, they automatically attack and you've got an energy bar below their health and I'm taking a lot of damage right there. Uh, but this is only a one out of one fight so these are the only ones I have to kill. And once it's full you can do abilities uh, which they didn't last long enough for me to show you any of their abilities. Uh, we'll get into that on another one but you can continue through expeditions doing that and fighting these guys. Uh, challenges I have not done the dragon yet but I've done these these are open on the certain days uh, like one opens tomorrow the next time that one's open is on Saturday but these are where you actually got to farm some of your pieces to promote some of these characters in the very earlier stages so you're gonna have to farm those okay so we completed that and let's see the mountain this is where you farm uh, basically for gold you do these twice a day so you want to make sure you do get them done basic simple three stage minions kill them off collect this stuff and you can go back to the trader and sell this stuff for gold really useful 
Um, I've kind of been holding off on the campaign. I need to collect some more stuff. I've uh, progressed so much so fast. Uh, the dragon was really cool to pick up pretty early in the game like that. Um, I believe they got some kind of sale going on that you can actually get one for like $4.99 and it gives you like 30 of the soul stones so you could probably uh, tear it up to actually you could tear it up to level 2 uh, 2 star so that's pretty cool. You see I've got it on auto it's automatically running through their skills each of them has a different unique skill uh, the one out front is basically the tank, the white gremlin looking dude he's a magic damage person uh, fight pit we'll jump in here and do one of those real quick as well so to to get promoted in fight pit you have to be ranked in the top five of that division right now I'm in copper two and looks like I need to beat at least the fifth person in here so Let's try this. We'll swap you out for you and let's try this setup. It's basically hero versus hero. This is actually another person. It's their PvP. Um, taking a lot of damage up front. Okay, we got that skill off. That'll stun that person. That one's going down. Somebody got charmed. This is uh, getting a little hairy. It didn't even do. There it goes. Okay. Lagged out a little bit, maybe. Okay, finished them off. That was kind of sketchy. But we got in the top five. That's cool. You can do five of these a day. Uh, in between them, it takes 10 minutes for the cooldown to uh, go down, just as well as the mountain. See, that still got eight minutes and 50 seconds left on it. Uh, challenges, I've never done the dragon challenge. I've only got one dragon. And that one's level 25. The loot is scrap of mux wax, mu muscle wax. Um, why not? Let's try it. I've only got one. Let's see how my dragon does. Uh oh, 1v1. Get him. Come on, can we hold this off? Well, he does have a, a, a siphon ability. That's pretty cool. Let's see if he does it. I'm holding up pretty well anyway. Well, this dragon is level 29. The one I'm fighting is level 25. One of three. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Let's see what we can do here. I'm going to save that last ability. Try to for the third third dragon. Because it looks like I'm going to be able to take this one out. And I should regen some health after the, uh, the stage. Oh, uh, but it's going to be close. Let's see how much health I regen. Okay, I'm back up to about three quarter, but I do have this ability going for me. Check this out. Boom. This drains life from them. And it's supposed to give you like 25% of it back or something, but we're doing massive damage. Smoke the dragons. My dragon is awesome. I do recommend you guys to farm this dragon. It is pretty awesome. Uh, Vince will tell you what they have going on throughout the game. Uh, free rewards, you know, it tells you every time a free reward is up. They do like four of them a day, so it's pretty cool. The stuff that I farm, see, you can sell it here, get gold for it. Always nice. And I always go back in here and I check for my heroes and the skills. I make sure I try not to let the skill points ever get built up because it's nice to actually have a stronger character. So we're going to put this in that right there go out and as far as campaign wise I'm right here in the campaign kind of at a point to where it's getting pretty tough for me to progress even with the characters that I have now I gotta I guess I need to you know go back and farm and level them up get them some experience and because as you can tell this guy right here he is immune to physical damage he can only be harmed by magic so it gets a little crazy as it gets up on in the level some. This is only a one of three. That ability is supposed to be able to have the chance to stun them. Uh, as you've seen, these spikes come out of the ground that came from the dragon. And we got two immunes to that here, so we're going to drop some lightning on them from the white furry looking guy. See if we can get a stun off on one of these dudes. Okay, it took them both down a pretty good bit took them out quick just got to get rid of the healer and we're on the final stage of this one dun, 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 dun. 
I've not tried this one yet, so if we beat this, it's going to be pretty cool. And we'll use the Siphon. That takes away from all the guys, so it's AoE. It's pretty nice. Throw a hill off. And looks like we are good. That dragon, I'm telling you guys, that dragon is OP. It, it's, 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 the, it's the biz. Um, let's keep pushing it. Let's see actually how far I can go. It's going to be interesting. How come, how far can we make it? All right, we got the physical immunity up front. He just got slapped down. Got that one charmed dead. All right, we got a new piece of something we can farm now. Cool. Number two. Well, like I said earlier, you, you do see the, the character's health going back up in between each stage. You do have regen on your gear that you do wear. So that's one unique part of the game. You, I mean, it's just a design of it see I didn't really have to heal I can save my heal for the third stage and the final stage and first we're gonna use the dragon then we're gonna hit him with the lightning then we're gonna drop these the stone on from Medusa throw a heal out for the tank drop the tanks ability took out the first row and leaves the final person in the back smack and we've done it that's awesome I would not have been able to do that without that dragon uh, most definitely and let's see if anything's back up yet it is not now this is supposed to randomly pop up after raiding a team after level 31 okay team level 31 um, heroes that was kind of sketchy and kind of tough uh, you can level heroes up outside of the battles as well by doing this you get these elixirs from going through the game so I'm going to level them up to 31 since we can already and see if that helps out with the next next fight definitely want to level this guy up he is only level 29 so we're going to use a big one and another big one and let's go ahead and jump him up to 31 with the rest of them um, starting to use her a little bit less we'll hold her at 29 he's okay at 29 I really don't use him at all hardly anymore except for on certain parts of like the challenges because he just does physical damage mainly so that's pretty nice but let's go back into the campaign since we leveled those guys up and let's try this one out uh, boss level 30 of faith healer okay and they have a dragon this is gonna be interesting only two to begin with so that's not too bad that's an easy round one because they'll make quick work because they have no no immunities to physical or magic damage those are the ones that are tough okay now here comes the physical immune plus two ranged in the back so we'll drop lightning early get some damage out and don't really have to worry about hills right now even though it is up Okay, Dragon's ability is ready. Alright, we got four abilities ready coming up on the final stage. Let's go ahead and drop stun those. Get the Dragon's ability off. Get the lightning drop. And let's watch for a heal when we need it. And... Are we not even going to need a heal? We didn't even need a heal. I'm telling you. The Dragon. All right, guys, this has been Dragon Souls. This is an extremely addictive and fun game. I've enjoyed playing it so far. As you can see, I'm level 31. I played it quite a bit. If you do want to play this game, you can download it from the link in the description below. It is a sponsored link, and it thank you for doing that because it does help the channel out, and it does support us here. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.